Hi people, this is your girl again, OVN. I am wishing you a Merry Christmas and a prosperous New Year. So today on the channel, I'll be showing you how I made this delicious locust beans rice stew. I'll be using goat meat for this recipe. I have my red bell pepper, tomatoes, onion blended together and I'm going to be putting my fry pan on the gas. Don't forget to use a low medium heat while cooking this. So I'm going to be covering this and letting it steam for 15 good minutes. So after 15 minutes, I'm going to open it up to check to see if it still has water in it. You can clearly see that it still has a little bit of water in it. So I'm going to be covering it back again and let it cook for another five minutes. I really want the water to get dried up. I don't want to see any water in it again. So now we've been cooking this for another five minutes and here we are. You can see that you can't even see, you know, so much water in it, like it's almost dried up. I'm going to be turning this together and I'll be adding my salt, my Maggi, all the spice that I'll be putting in it, you know, to make this delicious recipe. If today is your first time of tuning into this channel, please hit the subscribe button so when I post a new video content, you'll be the number one person to watch it. And don't forget to like, follow, and share. So now, like I said earlier, I am going to be adding all my spice and sauce to this delicious locust beans stew. So here we are, I am adding my Lucas beans. I am going to be turning this together. I already washed my Lucas beans. I advise you wash your Lucas beans because some people don't usually wash it. They just get it and pour it right into their stew. But sometimes it used to have some sand particles. Here I am adding my palm oil. You know me like always, I always like to mix whatever I'm cooking with palm oil and vegetable oil. It just gives me that colorful look that I want in my stew. I'll be covering this to cook for another five minutes. And here we are. Yeah, so this has been cooking for another five minutes. Next, I will be adding my protein into this stew. This is the goat meat that I am adding to eat. I already cooked this goat meat for one hour. I love to cook my goat meat for one hour because here in the US, you know, um, any meat you're buying, you need to really cook it really, really good. And I am going to be covering this to cook for another five minutes. Wow, just look at that. This looks really, really yummy and delicious. Who cooks rice to you without adding egg? You know now. So with this, I usually pinch my egg with a fork so that the stew can really go deep into the eggs. covering this again to cook for another three more minutes wow and here we are our locust beans white rice stew is ready i usually like to add a little bit of onion to eat 
you know now so that when i'm eating it, it i'll just be crushing on the onion so guys if today is your first time like i said earlier click the subscribe button you know so i can post more videos and content for you guys thank you so much for watching try this recipe and eat it with any delicious food you like it. i am going to be pairing this with white rice thank you for watching guys until i see you again next time i say bye